Hey guys, this is Clay, one of your anatomy fellows on the Kansas City campus. It's been requested by a couple students that I make this video. Uh, so when I was a first year, one of my tutors taught me a really great way to remember all the layers of the feet. She taught me a hand sign that represents all the muscles and tendons in each layer. And it was really helpful for me. It helped me keep all the layers straight in my head. And it was really helpful for the practical and on exam day. Um, some people like it, some people don't. So if you like it, uh, feel free to use it. Uh, shout out to Sarah for teaching me this in the first place. And uh, just quick disclaimer, uh, this is not meant to replace your lecture materials. Uh, this is purely supplemental, um, and it's not representative of everything in the lecture as well. So if there are any discrepancies in this video, please refer to the lecture slides that Joe made. She did a really good job with this lecture. So for our first layer, our most superficial layer, we just have an open hand like this. And this is our plantar apneurosis. Pretty easy. And then we have our first muscle layer, hang loose sign. So to make this, we have our abductor hyalysis, abductor digiti minimi, and our flexor digitorum brevis, hang loose. Now for our second muscle layer, we make a fist like this. And to make that fist, we have our lumbricals, which is really nice because that's what the lumbricals do in our hands as well. We have the tendon of the flexor digitorum longus. Then attached to that tendon, we have our quadritus plantae muscle. And then finally, we have the tendon of the flexor hollicis longus. So remember for the second layer, there are two muscles and two tendons to remember. The two muscles are our lumbricals and quadritus plantae the two tendons, flexor digitorum longus and flexor hollicis longus. Now for our third muscle layer, we hold up a three, like this, or the Boy Scout sign, whatever works for you. So to make this, we have our adductor hollicis, and just remember there are two heads to that, oblique and transverse, flexor hollicis brevis, and then our flexor digiti minimi brevis. Now remember for our flexor digiti minimi brevis, it, there's just a brevis, no longus. That's kind of weird, but that's just how it is. And then for our fourth and final muscle layer, we have our pads and our dabs. For our dab, it's dorsal interossei and those AB duct, so dab. And then for our plantar interossei, those AD duct, so pad, dab and pad. So I'll go over that one more time really quick. So for most superficial layer, open hand like this, it's our plantar apneurosis. Then for our first muscle layer, hang loose, abductor hollicis, abductor digiti minimi, flexor digitorum brevis. Second layer, make a fist. So we have our lumbricals, quadratus plantae, tendon of the flexor digitorum longus, tendon of the flexor hollicis longus. Third layer, we have our adductor hollicis. Remember those two heads, oblique and transverse. Flexor hollicis brevis and flexor digiti minimi brevis. And then finally we have our pads and dabs. All right, that's all I have for you guys. Uh, good luck with studying.